Welcome to another episode of EVH Care Discussion. My name is Eric Broadbent, and today's episode is being brought to you in part from our sponsors, the Van Halen News Desk and VanHalenStore.com. Today we're going to be taking a look at a, uh, an effects pedal, uh, once again, and it is EVH Care related, and it's none other than the 5150 Overdrive from MXR and Jim Dunlop. A great, great pedal. Uh, thanks to uh, my friends, my artist reps at Dunlop, I received this pedal last week and I've been itching to get on this thing and give it a demo and give it a whirl and show you what it can do. Um, a, lot of, a lot of discussion was taking place on Facebook and some different uh, forums and threads. And a lot of people are saying, well, if you have the 5150 amplifiers, the new the, from EVH gear and Fender, well, why would you, would you want this pedal? There's no need for it. And I actually argued the fact that I think you could put this pedal to good use even having an amplifier like that or having an amplifier of high gain of any nature, whether it's a Marshall or a, a Mesa Boogie or, or, or whatever. Um, the fact is, you can actually get an extra channel out of your amplifier by doing this. With the 5150s, as you know, you have a clean, a uh, bit of a dirty channel and then a great, insane lead channel. By, comp or by adding the overdrive pedal to your rig, putting it through the clean channel, you now potentially have four channels, um, three independent distortions. It's just, it's just great overall. So we're going to be taking a look at this, but first I want to be, uh, give a little shout out to a couple of people that were, uh, we played a little guessing game on Facebook. I posted the picture, what's in the box. You'll see the picture up on the screen probably there. And I just said, uh, you know, guess, and I'll mention your name in one of my videos. So uh, we got a couple of winners on that. And the first uh, guy who guessed it correctly was Jake C. Miller. Jake, congrats. And also our pal Johnny Bean, he guessed over on another page, I uh, guess what was in the box as well too. Probably wasn't too hard of a decision considering I've been talking about this for, uh, for quite some time. But speaking of talking about things for quite some time, let's get, uh, get down to it and let's have a look at this pedal and see what she can do. All right, well, we're gonna actually have a little bit of an unboxing video here as well. Let's crack it open and have a look. I know with dealing with Dunlop before when they've sent me pedals, they've packed them very, very well, so I anticipate no less with this one. Thanks, Dunlop. Yeah, right off the bat, you can see all kinds of extra packing material. They know what they're doing. Get rid of that. There we go. Nice matte finish with a bit of a stealth motif on it. Block logo 5150, very, very cool. This is, this is pretty awesome. Nice decor. Look nice up on the shelf with all the other uh, pedal boxes. Take a peek inside, see what we got. Right off the bat, you'll see your Dunlop uh, limited warranty certificate. If you read that over, you'll see there's about an, or a one year uh, warranty on the pedal. It's best to fill that out. We have a bit of an operation manual. It also has a few settings in there that you can kind of copy right off the bat to get a few kind of distinctive sounds until you find your, your own way with it. Nice keepsake for sure too. Probably best to keep these in the box when you're done with them to see if you have them for good. Also a quick guide written in about 12 different languages. I think there's only about two pages that are important and then it's just repeated for every language. Here again, good to have for reference, especially for people that have never used anything like this before. And then we have the actual pedal itself, the EVH 5150 Overdrive. Steel and plastic, nice. It feels a little different than uh, some of the other uh, MXR pedals. They, it's more of a, a lighter metal, like a tin type material, as opposed to the heavier steel, the, the chassis I feel like in the uh, MXR flanger. But uh, nonetheless, very well constructed. Nice flat finish here again too. Buttons are solid. Very nice construction and it's, it's a very nice looking unit. MXR logo looks sharp. Ins and outs plus a DC. And then on the bottom here, we have the battery door for your nine volt battery. I did find the battery door to find it to feel a little different than normal. That's a new new style that they've got by the looks of it. The knobs are all very, very solid, very responsive. There's nothing cheap feeling about this whatsoever. Uh, they, they move in small, small increments, uh, very nice and smooth. On off switch is solid. We've got the gate and we've also got the boost on there. That's, that's awesome. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, so that's a wrap of the EVH 5150 overdrive pedal from MXR and Dunlop. I hope you enjoyed the video. I had a great time filming it for you. Um, who is this pedal for? It's for everybody. It's, it's for the kids just starting out. It's for seasoned pros. It's for everything in between. Uh, it's for people running a little practice amp, a solid state, whether it's a, uh, maybe a boutique tube amplifier, it doesn't matter. This pedal it can find its way onto any one of our pedal boards. A great pedal at a great value. And I do recommend picking it up. And if you look at the uh, link down below in my description, I've got a direct link to where you can purchase this pedal from the vanhalenstore.com. And they offer not only the guaranteed lowest price on this pedal, but they also offer free shipping in the continental United States. So there's not much, not much else you could ask for. And while you're there, you can pick up some of the cool swag you get to see me wearing in some of these videos as well. Uh, they'll take good care of you. Tell them Eric sent you. So as always, uh, just to show your support, give me a like on the video. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already. And tell your friends, if you've got any guitar player buddies, send them my way. I think they might like the channel as well. So until next time, we'll see you real soon. Cheers.